solve my case. Hi guys, how are you doing? So um in five minutes I'm gonna be attending a virtual interview. Okay, the phone call interview happened at random today and the virtual interview is for 4.30 and it's 4.26 so in 4 minutes I'll be attending the interview and I'm going to be vlogging it so guys just pray for me although by the time you watch this thing I should maybe either I got a job by the job, one of those two, of those two things will happen so I'm just going to leave my camera on while I bring my laptop to attend the interview Oh, he said, hi, manager. I'm school three. She messaged me saying that um, she's not at the office today at 4.30 and she will be available for the interview tomorrow at 12.30 if that works for you. Tomorrow, tomorrow. Oh, although I have a meeting tomorrow at 12.30. Okay, no, 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 no. It's not tomorrow. It's Friday at 12.30, so it's fine. Tomorrow is fine. I just checked my schedule. <laughs> Give a life changer, Jehovah, the covenant keeping God pray forever. Amen. Guys, so I don't know if I even told you guys yesterday that or oh, in the course of this week that I'm going to be going for my driving class. My driving test rather. So I think in this country, everything, every job requires, most jobs, not every, requires a driving license. Uh, you already know that from back home, this girl is a is an international driver. So a friend of mine just spoke to me on Saturday that he has done his driving test and I'm like, please give me the link. Give me the... um question thing to read and I just went through it. I wanted to do it on Monday but I went I finished by 11 and they told me not to go by 11 that the crowd there is crazy and so I decided to go today that I have classes in the evening so the thing is I woke up this morning Thursday morning and I woke up to 7 so since the last time I read on Saturday I've not been able to read it I got there in the morning and they told me oh they needed my driving history I forgot it in the house so I went back home to get my driving history my um, driver's license and all the, all those good stuff and uh, when i got back they told me that my driving history had expired i got the driving history in july thinking i would be in canada in august so i had to i re i called them in nigeria i called the guy in nigeria and then i updated he told me the always update driving history only for me to call him and i say he, he's apologizing me that i did not know that it was updating driving history i wanted to do he told me i wanted to update driver's license i don't even understand so I've got them in Nigeria. I don't have anybody. My girlfriend's husband is coming on Monday and the guy said to be ready in two weeks. So let me just see. I know someone coming to Canada in April 5th, but we are not close. So I don't know if she will assist me. So I just thought to show you guys, your girl now has her G1 driver's license. So with this license, once my history comes, I will go get the G2. What do I even cover here? So this is how the G1 license looks like. Yeah, it shows Ontario. It's an Ontario license. Obviously, I live in Ontario, so. So does this mean I want to move to Alberta if I want to move? I don't even know. So all I need is I've got to my G1 driving license over to G. So I'm gonna speak with someone who I know drives an Uber in Canada. I've known him since Nigeria, but he doesn't I know him. So I'll just call him and ask him how much he would charge me to teach me how to drive on the road and I'll choose to drive in Grove because I heard Grove is easier to drive. I've never been to Grove so we'll go to Grove and practice my driving and that's how once I'm confident in driving I'll go and register for G. G. I should have my G license by next month latest April. And then your girl be ready to buy a car in Canada although buying a car is not in my short term goals but there's nothing God cannot do. If God favors your girl I'm buying a car ASAP. I just want to come here and tell you guys the latest updates when it comes to my the latest updates when it comes to my Canada journey. I'll talk to you guys later. Let me go eat. Oh, 
So yeah, the interview that was shifted yesterday is today. So I have an interview for 12.30 and I have an interview tomorrow for 12.30. So I just probably get a job or I get two jobs. Imagine your girl gets two jobs, although this job is clash on my, my classes, but we'll deal with it. Imagine your girl gets two jobs. It's, ooh, I'll talk to you guys later. Guys, I almost forgot that I told you guys I'll take you along for my interview. The interview is in three minutes and this is me and my laptop so maybe i'll just put the camera like this so that you guys can see what exactly i'm doing it's like i actually watch myself later long days and traveling back and forth it's, it's not really safe or, or productive for, for you yeah. um, so hi guys good morning this is actually midnight here i'm not supposed to be talking in my videos because the videos i'm seeing they're not talking so I think I'll just cut it here and give you videos that I will not talk. Whew. It's midnight and I cannot sleep because so many things are on my head. I'm basically using my two laptops. Let me show you. This is the one I'm using for a job and I'm on a call. And then this is, this is, I'm trying to edit the YouTube video. I don't know when the video is going to go up. But well, let me just take it to say hello to you guys. <clears throat> Hope you guys are well. Hi guys, so it's another day. Today is actually Friday and I had to leave my class to do this video. I know I look good. I don't need to ask how do I look. I look absolutely stunning. Now nah, this place is so dirty. Like a group came here at the end. So let me show you guys my outfit for today. Oosh. So this outfit is by my elder sister Jeff Signature. Oh, I need to show you guys the full fit. And I noticed this moment that I've actually lost weight. Not just here. Like I'm actually losing weight. I remember when I came and I wore this outfit like last month. It was big. But it's something I've been taking since Monday and I know I've lost, even in my tummy, I can say I've lost stitches and I'm grateful, I'm not complaining. Let me show you guys my full outfit. My sweetie don't go, she don't go. My sweetie say she no do love anymore. Me, I think say not play, come on, no be joke. My sweetie never do me like this before. Canada weather is actually bipolar. Now I yesterday it was raining. Midnight o'clock thing. We went back by one hour or so. And they say that's the real cold. So it's rain. Now hi guys welcome again to the channel it's your girl faith martins today is another day i look i look like i've lost weight too she first okay. told me that yeah i look like i've lost weight in my face so today is another day and today is the 14th of march 2023 i have an interview today and that's why i'm actually starting this vlog because i'm gonna vlog the interview process so I have an interview today and it's for the care industry. I'll just keep taking you guys along until I get a job. I'm currently in school. I have tests for 2 o'clock. Interview for 1.30. God help this girl. Oh, 